Hi, I'm Gareth McLernan, the European Artist in Residence for the William S. Haynes Company. Here in Just Flutes in London, one of my favourite places in the whole of the UK. And I've got a gold flute, haven't I? Or have I? No, I haven't. In fact, I have got a fusion, a Q fusion flute. What we have here is 9K outside and sterling silver inside. It's a fusion of two metals and so what we have is outwardly we have what looks like a, a gold flute but we have silver on the inside. Now this doesn't just look pretty, I mean it does look pretty, but this is all to do with the sound, the response. We have, whenever you mix metals you mix properties of materials. You get the sort of classic warmth of gold, but you get the agility and you get the shininess and the really nice brightness and projection of silver. Um, and so that's what this is all about. It's, you know, the cosmetic aspect is certainly pleasing. Like I said, it's very pretty. But the sound, it's always about the sound and preserving of this hen sound. And part and parcel of that is by adding a custom head joint to this particular flute. Um, the Q series of instruments, uh, we have a classic head joint normally, which is a more of an intermediate head, sophisticated enough, but not overwhelming to uh, a developing player. This is a professional head joint. That's what this is. This is made by the same person who made my head joint, who the same person who makes all the head joints on the custom line of flutes. So this is a very sophisticated P-cut head joint. So that's the engine of this flute. You're talking about 90% of how this flute sounds is to do with the head joint of, of, of the instrument. And so that's one of the really big differences in the Q Fusion. The, uh, the specification where we got high end, again, they got the same pads um, on, uh, on, on, these, on these flutes, the same springs as on the, the high end professional instruments. Um, all the options are, are available to you. This one has EMEC with a B foot joint you can add all the different bells, whistles, C-sharp, trill keys, all that sort of stuff if, if you'd like as well. Those are all standard options. Of course, one can talk about the sound and, you know, and talk about the effects and everything else, but it's such a personal thing. It's such a personal thing to each different player, especially when you're dealing with these very sophisticated head joint cuts that you know are, have been agonized over just to try and make the right sound and, and really finding the right hinge sound. Uh, the only way to really sort of appreciate this is to come along and try it. It's a, a, it's a really interesting combination of metals that gives you so many options in terms of your color, in terms of dynamic, your projection, your articulation, all these things, all these elements that we're looking for whenever we're looking at flutes at this level. So really highly recommend getting yourself down to just flutes and giving this little baby a test drive. I have nothing more to say other than to wish you happy fluting.